I don't feel threatened by them, but I am worried that they are coming closer because it means like there's something wrong with their actual habitat. It's an issue in many communities throughout BC, including here on the North Shore. Interactions with bears are on the rise. Well, one North Vancouver woman says she is fed up with many of her neighbors leaving their garbage bins out overnight. You know, the district says don't put your garbage out because the bears are going to get it and then the bears get used to it, they get habituated and they get, then they get euthanized. Whose fault is that? Catherine Casey took to Twitter earlier this week to express her frustration. She says she counted 23 bins left outside on her drive home from work late Monday night. She felt compelled to notify the district through social media. We sort of have a joke on my street um, in my little block that you can always tell the new residents. They do it once, a bear t rips apart their garbage and it never happens again. So I think maybe every, but I don't think all 23 of those residents are either new to the neighborhood or as someone yelled at me this morning, they're on shift work. I don't think all 23 of those households are on shift work. The signs in North Vancouver are everywhere, but clearly not everyone is getting the message. I really believe we are guilty, you know, because um, we live in the in their territory, but I, I do see, if I walk my dog, I do see people who's not careful enough. According to the BC Conservation Office, since April, nearly 200 black bears have been destroyed by conservation officers in BC, with many of the incidents the result of bears losing fear of humans in their search for food. Yeah, I think a lot of people are not paying attention. Uh, I, I mean, I, we try to pay attention with uh, food waste. They are habituated for backyards especially. Um, people don't realize bird feeders, little things that you don't realize attract them. So, I mean, the district does a pretty good campaign, but yeah, enforcement still needs to be upped, I think. In a statement to City News, the district says it has upped enforcement on carts and containers left out and is continuing to patrol neighborhoods. Those who are not in compliance with the bylaw will receive additional educational materials and a warning letter. If they violate the bylaw a second time, they will be subject to a fine. That fine is $100. The district adds since mid-June, 530 warning letters and 22 tickets have been issued. In North Vancouver, Greg Harper, City News.